Now we take a look at Protostar Heap Level 1. Um, the description says this level takes a look at the code flow hijacking in data overwrite cases. So uh, we get the source code. We have um, in the main function three struct internet pointers i1, i2, and i3. i1 allocates um, some space. Um, for as big as the struct internet is, then the priority is set to one and name is uh, set to a uh, to a eight byte chunk or a, a chunk with the size of eight. A two does the same, except that it the priority is two. Then we um, string copy two arguments from standard user input into name from i1 and i2 and we print out um, and that's a wrap folks. Our goal is to call the function winner and print out and we have a winner. Okay, so let's get it started. First try out the level as usual, heap level 1. So segmentation fault because we need two inputs as we can see here and we print it out um, and that's a wrap folks so let's view it in gdb first so gdb minus q heap one let's disassemble main let's break at the end And let's run the program. So A A A B B B B. Okay, now we would love to print out the stack, and we can do it. Um, um, so we want to print out the stack. So we need the address of the first malloc. So L trace. Um, opt protostar pin heap1 so there is the address of the first malloc and we will view again uh, one address more so x 32 x and the address so there we can see all the chunks so um we have the first chunk, which is this one. We have the second chunk, which is this one. We have the third chunk, which is this I2 chunk and the priority. And we have the fourth chunk which is this one. Okay, so we are able to write in the second and in the fourth chunk. As you can see here, so this is our A and this is our B. And what we can do is uh, with the first write, so with the AAAs we put in here, we can define um, uh, we can define an address uh, an address we will jump to with an offset of 20 because this is 20 so 1 2 3 4 5 so this is 20 sorry and um, and with the second address, we can define where we want to jump. So, so where do we want to jump? We can. So for for a jump or for to to call the winner, we need a call, as the name says. And the call we can use, we could use these puts here. So let's check where the puts is. 
So let's disassemble the puts first. So there we go. And let's check what, uh, what is at this address or where this address lies. This address lies uh, in the global offset table. So um, we, what we want, we want to change this jump here uh, that we don't jump to this address in the, uh, on the global offset table. We want to jump to, to um, the address of winner. So there we go. We need the address of winner. So let's get this first. Object dump minus t. Heap one. Oops, sorry. Um, op code stop bin heap one. And let's grab for winner. There we go. There is the address of winner. Okay. So. The first, so now let's build our attack string. So we want to, for first we want to define the address we want to overwrite, which is this address. And then we, we define with the second argument what the address should be. So let's call heap one and let's make two Python scripts here. A Python implementation, so Python minus C. Then we will print out First, our offset, so 20 A's. And second, we will print out the address you want to overwrite. So we want to pr uh, overwrite this jump here. So 74, 97, 0, 4, 0, 8. And wh with what uh, we want to overwrite it with print the address of the winner function. So 94, 84, 04, 08. And we have a winner. So what have we done? Let's recap this level real quick. So um, we have changed the call of puts right here or well, we checked uh, what the call of puts um, did and where did it jump to it jumps to um, an address on the global offset table and we overwrote this of a global at uh, this address at the global offset table with the address you want to jump to so um, the so we take two two arguments we take two arguments um, in our program in heap1 and uh, the first argument we can define um, what address we want to overwrite and the second argument we define with which uh, with what string we wanted to overwrite with so this was heap level one yep see you next time